hey y'all welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be about me packing for basic training so let's see what i put in this bag so you guys know what to bring to basic training as well tune in small carry-on bag that I'm going to be bringing to basic training and I'm going to be walking you through exactly what's in here I'm going to link the list of things that they recommend that you bring and they also have a list of items that they're going to issue to you so I may be going through this and kind of scaling back on some of the things that I have but I pretty much have brought like the bare necessities of what I need in order to do what they need me to do okay so um they do have a what to bring to basic list you will get this sent to you by your base education um, coordinator or by your recruiter. And they do also give you a recommendation on like what kind of shoes to get, um, as well as like what is going to be issued to you. So I'm going to go ahead and link that as well. Um, I believe it is on the Air Force website that I'm gonna send this to you. Okay, so what's in my suitcase? So the first thing, Running shoes, they look so big. I have big feet, but these are the running shoes that I use. I train in these already, so I brought these because I'm comfortable with these shoes. I'm also gonna bring some insoles because they will be issuing you uh, PT shoes uh, and they're not the most comfortable shoes. So I'm gonna bring insoles that are comfortable for me. Um, also what's in this suitcase, I have a small thing of makeup. I have a small pouch of makeup and the makeup is not for every day. You do not have time for makeup every day, but it is for whenever you take your pictures and whenever you go to graduation. Um, I have some writing utensils, so Sharpies, highlighters, pens, pencils. Uh, I have some envelopes. I will be getting stamps. I have some stamps somewhere around here. I don't know where they're at. And then I have two notebooks, one for school and one for writing letters. I have one pair of jeans. And then I have a um, packing cube with one month supply of pads. So like overnight pads, your normal like daily pads. And then I have some tampons in here as well. So make sure that you bring those because as women, we all know those are very specific to us. Like we want the brand that we want. So bring those with you. Okay, to the other side. So this is where it gets a little bit like a lot, like Asia, you're bringing a lot of stuff. So I showed you in another video that I am going to be bringing a few bras, some of which I got on Amazon um, and they actually work out very well. So I have five black sports bras, um, Nike, and then some, that she fit bra that I did a review on, I'm gonna be bringing that. Um, and then I also have two, of the Amazon um, sports bras, you're gonna wanna bring those. I've seen people say that they brought three. I've seen people say they brought eight. So I am bringing uh, five or six of these because I need at least one per day. I'm not gonna be wearing the same sports bra the next day. That's nasty in my opinion. So I'm not gonna be doing that. I brought two black tank tops um, for under my clothes. I brought two camel t-shirts. Uh, I have compression shorts. Okay, you're gonna wanna wear these. Like, if you don't wear compression shorts, like if that's not a thing for you, then I don't know if you need these, but I like to sleep in these and I also like them underneath my shorts. Um, the PT shorts have like this like mesh underwear in them, kind of like swim trunks. Um, but I'm gonna wear these underneath that because they're wide. So like if you like have your, if you're on your back and you have your legs up or something like that doing PT or some kind of ab exercise, you will be able to see through the shorts. And so I wanna make sure that I'm covered up. So I have um, five pair of these in here. So one per week. I have white tube socks for PT, already rolled up because I was trying to practice rolling socks. And then I also have 12 pair of cotton briefs. Okay, I'm not a brief girl. I had to purchase these. I got them from Amazon. I'm gonna link this in a lot of different items um, in the description, but you do need to be wearing briefs. You need to wear briefs or another kind of style that is like full coverage. You cannot wear thongs to um, basic training for whatever reason, I don't know, but uh, I think it's because of all the running and sweating that you're doing. It's just not comfortable, I guess, but I'm not a brief person, but I will say that I did buy 12, a pack of 12 
of briefs. As a woman, you know there's never too many pairs of underwear. So they come in three different colors. I'm sorry, not three, four different colors. And it is apparently not recommended to bring black because black carries lint, but everything on that list that they told me to bring was black except for the socks. So it is what it is. Um, so yeah, that's the clothing that I purchased or that I'm bringing to basic training. So we're going to put that back. I have those in a packing cube as well as my like toiletries. Now, the toiletries, I don't know because I was told that you're gonna get everything you need. I'm a black woman, okay? So I don't know if you have everything that I need because I don't, they, they said to have a black section, but I wanted to make sure I had everything that I needed. So I know that me having locks, I'm gonna need some gel to like have my hair pulled back with. So I brought Eco Styler gel. I don't know if you can have razors. They said that you can, they said that you can't. So I'm just gonna bring them just in case. I don't know when I'll have time to actually shave at least my armpits, like I'm gonna try that. So I brought razors with replacement blades. Cough drops are like a thing that like people swear by to bring. So I brought a container of cough drops. I have a container that has one hair tone, one hairband that matches my skin tone, one hairband that's black, cause like black is universal. Hair ties that matches my hair tone or my hair, my hair color and then black hair ties as well as some bobby pins that match my hair color okay so they say that you can have black hair ties like if your hair is blonde it's okay to have like black hair ties but for the bobby pins apparently they're supposed to be the same color as your hair so please make sure that you're getting gold if your hair is blonde black if your hair is black brown if your hair is brown um i also what else do i have in here i have q-tips if you're a q-tip person i got a pack of q-tips um, a lot of this stuff I already had, so I didn't have to purchase it. That's why I didn't mind like packing it because I shop in bulk, so I always have things. Also, am bringing um, this is a bar soap, so I'm gonna be bringing bar soap instead of like liquid soap because it's just easier. Um, edge control so that my hair can be like laid. Uh, a Casio watch. This is what people have been recommending the most. Like people have been saying that you need to have a black watch. I'm an Apple watch person, but you cannot have an Apple watch in basic training. So Apple watch, no go. You need to have this watch that way you can have an alarm as well as um, a stopwatch, you know, like timing and things like that. Um, I'm bringing Band-Aids. Band-Aid has this really cool brand of like new like skin tone, band-aids why is this not focusing guys so i'm gonna be bringing these because running a lot you might need these for your feet okay um and then even if there's like any kind of like injury also i have people who swear by bringing um baby wipes so i have crazy amount of baby wipes already in my apartment so i just pack those um toothpaste i brought hand sanitizer also, people swear by bringing a nail a nail clipper, so I, I packed that. I have a nail file, quarters on cream, just for like itching and irritation. If like the sand or grass like irritates my skin, because I definitely have sensitive skin. Whatever brushes you need, so I have my edge control brush and I have my like normal boar bristle brush, and then my actual like wet toiletries. Okay, so um, I have my hairspray like that I use to moisturize my hair um lotion shampoo conditioner and i have like these like little clear bottles that i got from kroger um you can also get them from amazon i have a list that i have purchased from amazon as well and then also gel sunscreen deodorant face wash face moisturizer okay so that's everything that i have packed in my bag right now um, I'm moving, so I'm doing this early. I don't actually leave for basic training until like four weeks from now, so I'm actually like way ahead of schedule, but I have to do this now so that way I do not um, fall behind and I don't miss anything. So if you have any questions, if you have any comments or concerns, please leave them in my comment section. If you wanna know any more about basic training and my process, please let me know in the comments. Make sure you subscribe so you get everything that you need. Um, and then make sure you have those notifications on so whenever I post a new video. 
you know immediately. Thank you for watching my channel. Hope that you have a great day and wish me the best of luck at basic training.